Okay, so in this video I'm going to show you how to make a Windows Phone application that says Hello World. Uh, really simple again because it's really just C Sharp. Um, very similar to the Windows Form application, but uh, here so we're using Silverlight. Um, so select uh, Windows Phone application and uh, put in uh, Hello World uh, Phone or something. And you click OK. Creates all the files for you again. So like the OS 7.1 because that's the most recent one. Now, uh, one thing I realized on uh, Windows phones is that you can't use uh, unsafe code, which means that uh, all the image processing um, will have to be done in uh, in, in uh, functions that exist already, and you can't access the the pixels at uh, using pointers, which is usually faster. So uh, you got your uh, XAML form, which is um, it's just uh, an interface builder. Uh, and here's the code for it right next to it. And you have the toolbox, just like in Windows form. So um, let's look at this application bigger. So you got the, my application, the name, of course, as usual. You can um, change all those words by changing the text here. Uh, so we're going to call this Hello World or uh, Main. And my application up there, that one we're going to call Hello World. So I'm going to dock this. Back where it belongs. Uh, now, um, same story. I'm, I'm going to put in a button um, into the main body. Uh, now, the button will have um, the text. This is the content. Click me. And um, Just like uh, on Windows Forms, uh, when you double click on it, it doesn't work. You go in event and you add a click event. Double click on that. Okay, that's yeah, because it's behind it. Nice. Um, so, upon the clicking, I want a message box to show. Uh, and uh, it will say hello world. All right, let's execute this. <clears throat> now, uh, be careful because the name that you put here for your application, hello world phone, will uh, become the name that uh, your app will be called. So, um, if you don't want to get into the trouble of uh, renaming everything at the end, um, put in a, um, a, a name that uh, means something. Um, I had to go through the trouble of renaming uh, my app, and um, seriously, I don't want to go through that again. All right, takes a bit of time to load, but it's very nice. And then when I click there, it says "Hello World" in the text box. Um, and uh, of course, because it's C sharp, you can uh, use all the other tools, uh, just, just like in Windows form. Um, you can have a label, text box, everything you want. Uh, but that we'll learn in another video.